Hello everybody and welcome. Today is the day before Thanksgiving, which means it's Christmas time. So we're actually gonna decorate the house for Christmas. We got some new posters up. We have a Back to the Future one, a Stranger Things one. All sorts of exciting things happening today. But first, we actually need to go put up lights on top of the house before we get dark. So that's the first goal. So yay, I'm scared of heights. So hopefully this doesn't come into epic fail vlog where he falls and dies. Da -da -da -da. I don't know if you guys can see that, but right by the horses, there's a whole bunch of little deer. Um, there's a little baby over there. There's a cat right there. Ah, look, Santa's deer showed up just in time. And then even more over there, there's a huge flock over there. But deer, cats, and horses. What a vlog. I don't know. It may sound a little weird, but we always have deer in front of our house. It's just a really common thing around this area is deer. It's just what you see all the time. Um, about around five to seven inch, you'll always see a deer. So that's pretty cool. Who doesn't love seeing a deer? So lights have been hung and now you'll never guess with all this red behind us, we're at Target, the best place around. And I want to show you guys a little bit of the Christmas stuff. I already showed this a little bit in the last vlog, but they're just starting to put it out. So now I'll actually show you what they actually have. And they got a whole bunch of Elf on the Shelf stuff to start with. So that's pretty neat. Do you ever just feel like you have too many cookies that you need a whole shovel for? They got it. Or how about giant cookie and, gin and Christmas tree? Gingerbread and Christmas tree. These are kind of cute though. Ooh, it's rubber. Ooh. Not what I was expecting it to feel like. And of course, Christmas isn't Christmas without the Christmas shark. Everyone's favorite thing. And I still, to this day, don't understand the legs on the head. I think it's a very weird thing. Like, I can get the turkey, maybe the flamingo. But the legs? A little weird. I like all these little Santas right here and snowman. They're just kind of, they just kind of sit there. They're cute. I like this one, especially the workshop Santa. I like him the most. Did you ever want a huge one? They also have those. I like all these little cars. I think they're very cool. Especially this one, the Ford with the tree on it. I think it's super cute. Even the taxis with the present are fun too. Uh oh, it looks like someone's stealing batteries around here. We got a battery thief. They got a good deed thing if you try it out. Well, let's see what's my good deed that I need to do. Tell me Santa. No, I don't want to sing Santa. No. No, I don't want to do that. Oh my goodness, look. It's the thumbnail. Because it looks like I'm in Winter Wonderland. Christmas is here. It's starting now. And who knew that the hardest part of playing Christmas stuff was going to be the stockings. So we wanted to do red and green. But they had no bees in it, so... They had plenty of J's, but no B's. And they had no B's in red either. A struggle. But they had it in white, so we're gonna do red and white now. Which works. I think that works out pretty well. And you can see that shelf are slowly getting emptied one by one. Like, it was so full the other day, but now there's not much. So we are back home. Things are starting to happen. The couch has been moved from the window over to this wall. Coffee table and you go take to the garage, but we decided to put the Christmas tree over by the window Just so we can show off like every other person does with their Christmas tree And it's kind of exciting. We got a couple of stuff from my mom's put it over here making some dinner So I'll show you what we're doing and how we're decorating So we got the tree up um, we're, we're pretty much there on it, but the only problem is as you can see a couple of the areas are missing lights I guess they burn out or that's what we're assuming so we'll have to get some new lights on the tree so that's going to be fun but we'll just get a strand I think it should just be able to do all the light and my mom even passed down a couple things along the way so this is a snow globe that I've had since I was born and I'm saying I put it up it plays Toyland on it so that'd be fun and there it is 
one of my favorites. So it has Santa going around the sides. There's a whole bunch of toys in it. Passed by a toy store. And you have all these little toys around it. It's pretty cute. For some reason, it's not wanting to wind up, so I'm going to have to get into it and see what's clogging it. But besides that, it's great. All right, so I was able to get the whole tree decorated and we have a good mix of me and Bryce's on there. And I also found a strand of lights that we had, so I'm pretty happy with that. It doesn't look bad. The body has, is a little darker, but not bad. Yeah, you can barely tell that I put lights in it. So, nice. Very good. And we have a whole bunch of cute ornaments in here now. Yeah. So, now it's time to do nutcrackers, all the rest of the stuff. I think it'll look nice, though. We got some Christmas pops going on. We got Pop Goes Christmas. I mean, Punk Goes Christmas. So that's even better. And then hopefully we can get some of these posters switched out. That'll be pretty cool for some Christmas ones. And Bryce just put this in the bathroom. This is super cute. We have a little Christmas tree with our little Christmas bird. Aw. And we actually kept out the Halloween radio because... One of these days, this will be a theme to the Jungle Cruise bathroom, or Adventure Line bathroom. There's a couple of items, but we decided that will actually probably fit it pretty well. So, Halloween, whoa, <laughs> and Christmas. Dracula's around here, oh no. <laughs> and we also threw up this little sign right here. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. All right, so we are pretty much done for tonight because, you know, it's late, it's midnight. We gotta go to bed soon. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving and that's gonna be a whole bunch of fun and you guys will join me along with it. So I wanna show you what we got done so far. We got a tree. So our tree is pretty much all the way decorated. We wanna add a little thing around it just to brighten it up a little bit like Something along these lines, like the snowflakes, ribbons, or something. Just kind of give it a base, and then everything else can be on it. But one of the cool things we got... So... One of the nifty things we found at Target was this... Where... It'll turn on your Christmas tree. That's pretty cool. It's like one of my favorite things. You just get a flip a switch and you get Christmas. Who doesn't love that? And then over here, we got a couple of other things. A little snowman, making a little checklist, making, making a checklist, checking it twice. A nutcracker. And we got our Christmas blankets. Yeah, we're still a little bit messy right now. And then we got Nutcracker Gingerbread House. I don't think there's anything in him. Nope. And then we got our Big Band Christmas album. You know, gotta love the little kid on there. It's just like, ah. And we're going to get a couple of things for the pillows over here. Santa blanket. Um, over here we got more gingerbread. And then over here we also got more. The JB, Jake, and Bryce. The Naughty and Nice Meter. Extra festive. We put the snow globe out here, which is also really cute. Couldn't get it fixed, which is a shame. Got some nutcrackers over in this corner. Merry Christmas. Yeah, I think it turned out pretty cute. We want to add more, but just right now, this is where we're going to stop for tonight. Trust me, we got, trust me, we got a whole lot more right here. But, you know, who doesn't love Christmas? I know it's the day before Thanksgiving, but, you know, it just makes you happy and it feels good. Is you know, always, usually I'm one of those people who says, oh, no Christmas before um, Thanksgiving, but this year's rough. And, you know, I don't blame anyone for getting Christmas out super early like i understand why people are getting out in november and stuff because it just makes you happy and 
It's a very cozy feeling instead of just be like, oh, you know, just a normal house. I, I get it. I understand why everyone's like Christmas right now. But like one of the things we did tonight was just sit around the TV, like not even with the TV on, but sit over here and just enjoy the Christmas lights. Um, you can see a little bit of the ones out there on the roof, but got those up. Um, that kind of sucked because half of it, I was really hoping to get up all the way, all of it on the house. But I just realized today, not all our house has gutters, so I need to get ways to put the lights on without attaching them to the gutters, if that makes any sense. So I think Home Depot has something along those lines, which I think we'll get in the next couple days. But yeah, um, we're there were a couple of pillow cases. But just sit around, enjoy it. We had the lights off and just the Christmas tree. Had music playing on the record player, which is just very delightful and very cheery and just really relaxing. And you know what? I think we could all use that during this season because, oof. And, you know, as weird as it sounds, I've been decorating a room for Christmas this whole time for the last two weeks. But this finally got me in the Christmas mood. Which sounds so funny where I'm like, I've been decorating for Christmas two weeks straight. And that's been exhausting. That's why I haven't had any videos out come out. That's why I haven't had any videos come out lately because I've been exhausted. I've come home, I leave. So pretty much my day starts as I wake up, get ready, eat breakfast, head straight, straight to the escape room, decorate, build, all that. And then I come home at like... 10 o'clock at night, if not later, 11 sometimes. And I go make dinner and then go to bed. That's been my life for the last two weeks. So that's why there hasn't been a lot of content coming out. So I apologize for that instead of being like, I don't want to give you any crappy content and be like, oh, I guess this will hold you over. Here's me doing the same thing over and over again. But luckily this was a day off. Um, <laughs> I think my body was starting to make me get sick just to have me take a break because I was starting to really sniffly and whatnot. So that was really weird. But then today when I did all this and I took a COVID test and I didn't have that. But today, as soon as I started just relaxing, my body was okay. So good for me. I'm glad my body was like, oh, you just need to rest because I did. I really did just need to rest. It's surprising what your brain starts to do when you need it but I think this is going to help me with my creativity and whatnot at work and I need that but I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog because you know it is super fun I'm going to go turn off all the lights and go straight to bed but I'll see you guys tomorrow for Thanksgiving and be very thankful for everything so we'll see where we decide to run water next